All right, time for our second international friendly, and it will feature China HB from Gabon, Jesse Tuvanta from Zimbabwe, Sulu Marguerite from China, and Desan Koba from France. Do you know that France won the World Cup at their home country? That's amazing. Well, anyway, back to the base, and it will be featured in the Emerald Course. That's where we're going to play in this race. So on your marks, get set, and go! Last phase of the day is on the way. Please watch out running down the aisles. And Jesse pauses for a moment. And now they're shaking the trees. Who's gonna have control? That's on Corbar has control, followed by Sue Marguerite and Jesse Tuvanta from Team Zimbabwe with the opening toss. China should be maybe caught in traffic here, and he's heading for the water as number two, who is also heading for the water, takes the next B bus. Meanwhile, Jesse takes a speed bus, trying to control the crowd. And it looks like that's on Cobar has the lead at this point. And the next speed west belongs to the Red Barrett, Lou Marguerite. China should be need some serious catching up to do. Number one will have the next command on the speed bus. Number eight is all alone, devastated to be in last place behind the pack. But they get the speed bus, trying to catch up with one of these superstars. He's still in last place. Meanwhile, Slew Marguerite is catching up to Deson Colbert. Jesse took the next speed bus, and number seven pauses for a moment. Trying to finger control. And number two gets the speed bus. Number seven and eight are battling for deal life. And number seven will leave number eight behind. And he's back in this one. Number eight behind for a second time in this race. And China should be from Gabon takes the next speed bus. He's safely in fourth place. Let's see who has the next command of the speed bus. It's number seven who have the next command of the speed bus. Number eight is all alone in last place again. What's gonna happen? Number eight gets some help, but we're about to have a winner back up in front. So little Marguerite the Red Baron does it. And it looks like number two will wrap up the speed bus for today's events. So here is your winner of our final race of the day. Team China's Red Baron, Saloon Marguerite! And that, ladies and gentlemen, concludes tonight's Halloween Extravaganza! Later on, we're gonna see Trick or Treaters come out, I hope. And be sure to tune in tomorrow night for more exciting chalices. And keep a look out for our costume project! No matter which character we're doing, we'll make sure that it will be fulfilled with a top hat, tuxedo vest, and, you guessed it, a cloak cape. It will be a super handsome mascot to be super fancy. So until then, keep on smiling. Bye for now, and have a safe and happy Halloween to everyone.